Alright, well, welcome back to possibly the final chapter of, um... <laughs> of Pantsless Suit Man. We're gonna go beat Raven's up... Adventures with no pants. <laughs> We're gonna go beat up, like, the worst cop. Like, there are cops everywhere that we beat up, but, um... Goddamn punk! No. God, the go to hair! This move is so good. It continues to be really good. I also like how the cops just seem to like have the worst AI. Whoa, there's a guy with a there's one with a gun. Uh, I think. From experience with guns and beat em ups, you should probably take him out first. Yeah. Oh, we can't get that. It's okay. Somebody's shooting that. Or was that just? Oh, fucking uh, lizard has the gun. <laughs> 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 Something about that is really funny to me. <laughs> you pickpocketed the gun. <laughs> oh, we got a drink. Oh, hold on. Sorry about that. No problem. Alright, so. That was high demo. Uh, <laughs> so the cops as usual are poor. I find I find very odd. <laughs> One of the no pants on because they're totally not gay, bro. I feel like out of all of our cronies, I feel like Mike, the Jackie Bryant looking dude, would be the most likely to be like, We're totally not gay, bro! Why did I think that was a door? <laughs> Watch in suspense as Melly figures out, <laughs> figures out where the front gate is. Okay, there we go. There was like somebody around there with the... I forget if we uh, talked to him last time. But I saw somebody there that. Ah, oh, damn it! <laughs> that doesn't matter because uh, it's kind of around the way anyway. But out of Dan to Dan out. We're gonna be. We're probably gonna get drunk again because uh, it looks like we're gonna just be in a whole bunch of fights at this point. And, uh, I don't remember what items we have. Probably a good idea to check before we, uh... We have, we have the drink. That's all we remember. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Oh, we got the chicken. And the drink. Uh, brass knuckles, like, need to be on, though. Like, that's non-negotiable. Because <laughs> those things hurt. What's happened so far in the adventures of Irvish, Urban Irish Scottish British Man? We basically just started. Uh, so not much yet. Oh! We fought a bunch of cops <laughs> that have like no health and no money. <laughs> 
I didn't even notice I picked up the nightstick and he was just like, eh, whatever. I love how low tier the cops are. Like, they're just like... I think the common thugs are more powerful than them. They barely fight either, they just kind of stand there. Maybe occasionally shoot a gun. Yeah. Funny thing is, the guy that had the gun didn't even fire it, it's just lizard beat the shit out of him and took it. I wonder if he still has it. Uh, Lizard? G. Is there a way we could check that for our, uh, our friends here? I, I don't think so. Nah. That would have been a nice feature. <laughs> but. Uh, the police station, this will be fun. Oh, we gotta go back to the the, uh, the hole, I think. Or Scarab Tavern, or whatever it feels like being called that particular day. Shut up and try to avoid the cops. <laughs> I hate walking! Makes me so mad! Fuck you, car. <laughs> Pedestrians are the right away. <laughs> I'm so tired of walking, I just want to buy some pants. Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> Who's that guy? What? <laughs> I wish I had friends. Alright, I'll see ya. <laughs> Just like beat the hell out of him and be like, what trouble? What do you mean? <laughs> what are you talking about? Goddamn punk! Oh shit! They killed oh. Melvin! <laughs> and tr whoa! <laughs> okay, she's not dead. Uh. This is not how I expected this to start. <laughs> this must be what I get for lying to you guys. Oh yeah, I guess she did. Wallace threatened Melvin and me, you know. He wanted this. Wanted you to go after Zanetti. Is this me or did the music get like killer 70? A little. The <laughs> organization. Well, do you know where I can get some pants? From the beginning. That's enough. This information doesn't come free, you know. That's enough, Tracy. You can make it up to me by buying me a beer. I'm pretty sure it would just spill out at this point. Turn on the radio. I want to hear how the ball game turned out. Well, with our ball games, uh, I think uh, Beezer 12 Washing Beard got like 10 points, and uh, Sir Mix a lot struck out. And Farmer got a home run. <laughs> I read you, you're right. Oh, that guy that we saw I once. Question for you. That shit you were just talking about. Is it true? Also, is it true I'm just Russell Crowe? I think there's something you ought to do before I take you in. Put on pants. You're gonna go see the Please. chief. I'll take you there right now. <laughs> or just, you know, go to the chief. So yeah, this episode started off with, uh... Two of our, uh, home characters dead. And we can loot their bodies, And right. you can steal from him. He's got a knife! <laughs> Oh my god, wait a minute! <laughs> I got the shotgun now! <laughs> well... In the immortal words of Chris Redfield, you got a shotgun. Target! Hey. 
Okay. So. Hey. Yes? Ow. Oh. Alright, goodbye, Felipe. Yeah. Sorry, man. Well, I mean, Russell Crowe over here is like. Oh no. Oh, well. Not one of these missions. <laughs> yeah, this is you only have to go to the police station. That's true. Yeah, this really <laughs> threw me for a loop here. No time for pants, we're just stuck with this now. <laughs> I didn't expect this guy to, like, be our begrudging friend. Oh, Chester just did, like, a... Oh, God. Wait, Yeah, seriously. Also, I think he just added to my jungle combo by shooting him while he was in midair. That's, that's kind of incredible. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, that. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Lizard's almost Can we dead. Take... Can we take stuff off your health, though? Yeah. I, I admittedly did that by total accident. <sighs> See, now the cops are kind of a challenge because there's like a lot of them. <laughs> Cop belly to belly suplex. All right. Damn it. Okay. Now oh, we're drunk. <laughs> well, okay, that was that was guard. No. Damn it. Bro. <laughs> Go to hell. I, th I, I think I just did my best Mongo impression by accident. You die. Kill you. <laughs> I like the slow mo car about to hit us. I mean, the, the cops like got better AI all of a sudden. Uh, is this effect gonna wear out anytime soon? I feel like this is lasting a lot longer than it used to. <laughs> what? Uh, game? Hello? <laughs> Can I, like, not be drunk now? Ugh. Yeah, we'll probably have to restart this. Ah! <laughs> uh, that sound. Yeah. Oh no! God! <laughs> well, um, <laughs> if he's still alive, then sure. <laughs> uh, one second. I'm like occasionally taking bites out of a big burger right now. Uh, da, da, da. Probably gonna do some editing on this video because I have to stop and start a lot tonight. Okay. It's a bacon cheeseburger with pickles. It's pretty good. Ugh. 
when I found out I liked uh, bacon cheeseburgers, uh, interestingly enough, was from that game Streets of Rogue, which turns out that, um... That game's sense of humor sucks, but it did lead me to discover the bacon cheeseburger, so it's got that going for it. It's a shame, because I actually kind of like that game otherwise. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, car. I don't think Chester really has any problem. Uh... <laughs> They, get, they stole Buzazima's gun. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh my god. He's just shooting people right in the face. <laughs> Thank you for the tag team juggle. It's like I'm playing tag two all over again. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> just for doing a tag of cold. <laughs> I don't think I add Chester to Tekken 7, I wonder. Oh, okay, sorry. Jesus, alright. <laughs> 15 bucks. Get out of here. You got what I spend on groceries when I'm at the store. <laughs> alright, we got the med. Uh, do we still have drink? Okay, so yeah, this is the timeline where we didn't die, so... Yeah, whatever, bad trip. Uh... They're not use. I think, like, the... Yeah, I think the medicine healed it, uh, better. Oh, uh, before we go any further, let me... Okay. Alright, let's drunkenly go to the police office. Best state to be in when you go to the police office, really. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Copper, how's it going? <laughs> okay. Oh no, elite cops. <laughs> you can kind of just tell looking at them, huh? Tells me a lot of health. Yeah. Somebody keeps shooting us. Ugh. Oh god, yeah, those guys. Who the hell keeps? Oh, that's that's obnoxious. <laughs> Wait, what the fucking? Who's the Splinter Cell guy back here? <laughs> Sam Fisher, no. <laughs> yeah, this blur is rough. <clears throat> Totally messing up the bit more than our end. <laughs> Fucking Sam Fisher over there just uh got juggled by a car. Okay. <laughs> Fisher, we have your target, some dude with no pants on. <laughs> Wait, did he just disappear? <laughs> the hell was that? We can escape. I don't know what that really... I think we just... Yeah, we'd have to go back and do this all over again, so... <laughs> well, that cop is fucking dead. <laughs> yeah, most of the stream is just beating the shit out of cops. This stream's great. <laughs> Whoa! He has a gas mask on! I think. Man, Chester might actually die. Um... It's a good thing we have oh more no. than... It's a good thing we have more than one uh, health item on us. 
Oh my god! <laughs> How did I do that? <laughs> That Doctrine Dark's not feds, though. He's... I like how fighting EX Layer just kind of... Sorry. Doctrine Dark is an X cop. Yeah. Cop. It's odd, like, fighting EX Layer retcons so much of his story that he's just, like, some kind of weird dude now. Like, he doesn't really have anything to do with anything. <laughs> he's just like, oh, yeah, he wants to become more powerful. That's, that's, uh, that's it. Oh, but that <laughs> You have a. <laughs> Chester, I swear to God, you better not die on me. Ah! I better not die on me. Alright. We're gonna give Chester some chicken. <laughs> Everybody, just don't die. Yeah. <laughs> There's so many. For some reason, yeah, the cops just never get up from this attack. Oh my god, where's Chester at? He's almost dead. Okay, there he is. Chester, you're the one with the gun. Come on. <laughs> I, I think. He might have lost it at some point. Might have used it up. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay, he's got a he's got a bat now. <laughs> you tell that guy's advanced. He got out of it. Yeah. Well. I still don't know what technique is. All right, Chester. Wait, he's also, he's got drink on. But I can't get him to use it? Weird. Maybe okay. get a status? Oh, maybe, hold on. Nah, it's just his moves list and his abilities? Yeah, we can't get him there. I guess it's only for, like, the one-on-one -on -one fights. Oh, probably. That's kind of inconvenient, actually. Uh, Alright, well, whatever health items I get, I'm just going to give to him now. Or maybe not. I think we're, like, pretty much there, but... You have to go down to the underground garage, though. Yeah, that's like to the side here, I think. I remember because I accidentally uh, went here once. Probably have to fight more cops, but, you know. Oh, okay. We just save here. Oh, he's over there. Okay. Should probably do that. Yeah. <laughs> I can't again believe you witnessed it all either. <laughs> I smell a book deal already. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna make a video game out of it. <laughs> they ended up ripping her off for royalties though, so it was kind of a kind of a tragic story. I have full health, by the way. Uh, what do you say? Hey. Alright. Security's set up front, but you should be able to get in through the service entrance, the chief's office on the second floor. Okay. Yeah! Alright. <laughs> I'm... I wonder if we should take the shotgun or the, <laughs> the brass knuckles. Probably the shotgun. <laughs> I 
Actually, um... He said no problem getting in through the front. Uh, so I imagine we're gonna have to fight more cops, so I'll just save it for one more. have to go in... I think you have to go in through the bottom. Uh, through the... the garage? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Alright. I think that's like essentially what we've been doing. <laughs> like... Advice, uh, beat up the cops? It was pretty fascinating. Oh. <laughs> right, this guy. Right, I forgot that this guy is like the main whiner of the group. <laughs> I actually I actually read the quotes when like they do actions when you play as them. Do you know what his quote is when he like holds somebody up? It's like it it's like I'm a victim of circumstance and it's all your fault. <laughs> it's like I think it's your own damn fault for being Spindle as portrayed by Steam Tetsky. By who now? Gene Snitsky. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it ran into any more pro-tech and player bosses. Not yet. Uh, Wendell's pretty easy from what I remember. He just has a lot of health, but it's not really a lot of... Oh god, he's got the brass knuckles! Wait a minute! I actually forgot to, uh... Ugh. Uh, my had to... Purposely die, just to... I forgot how much this guy looks like Meatloaf. He in no way sounds like him, though. What? <laughs> Wait... <laughs> Come on, I'm trying to die here to equip that weapon. I'll make sure you get special treatment. All right. Let's do this the right way. I like how every time we're in a boss fight, we never know how to like prepare adequately, so we're just always like beat the shit. Alright. Yeah, that's where I get. To be fair, we also didn't know Wendell was coming. Yeah. Oh God! Oh no, he's got the, he's got an electric thing. His grunts too. <laughs> Who? I, I gotta look up to see who voices this guy. <laughs> I forgot who it was. Oh, th sorry, lizard. Ah, I was gonna heal, but. I'll make sure you get special treatment. All right. So how long until you until you think we start stage staying? This guy doesn't seem that hard. I feel like. I feel like, um, we should just, like, down that bottle of medicine. Hey, Arba. <laughs> so we're beating up a whiny cop. It's kind of a redundant statement, but... <laughs> Yeah, it's like he's just running into things. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like he's gotten hit by that every single time. 
getting right up in there. <laughs> oh god! Problem is, yeah, he eventually brings those out. Not that than the uh, taser. Yeah, the taser was really nasty. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Okay, okay. No! Come on! There we go, okay. God, Wendell sucks! <laughs> yeah, hair. Oh, yeah! Maybe he's got something good on him. We might get a cutscene. No? Oh no. He's just gone. <laughs> Alright, um. Alright. Man, they throw a boss at you and then immediately just throw you into another, like, game fight. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing the cops just never get up when I do that for some reason. One of these guys better have a health item on them, I swear to god. <laughs> That one's got a gun. Yeah. I need Sam Fisher over there. Alright. Another bite of burger. I wish I could give my character a burger. Maybe he'd, like, get health. <laughs> Cheering anything. <laughs> this game's trying super hard to be Yakuza. When did Yakuza first come out, actually? It might have been after this. Yeah. It's funny because there was like that simple two, like 2000 game called like Yakuza Fury that everybody thought was a. <laughs> Didn't even notice that was a mechanic. <laughs> I know I'm gonna die, but. Oh, I don't have enough health to do that. I wanted to see, like, all four of them just tumble down. <laughs> Wait, did we just get him in an infinite? Very nearly got him in an infinite. <laughs> okay, who else is left? Oh, you. <laughs> that was probably one of the silliest <laughs> That was probably one of the silliest uh <laughs> Game over some i I'll say hey. Yeah, this last chapter is rough. I feel like the problem is in this game is that sometimes it's just really hard to prepare. Because you don't know when to do that, you know? It's like they're throwing shit like this at you, so you're constantly, like, whenever you have, you know, have health items, you pretty much need them, like, at all times, so. Uh, camera? Hello? My character's not drunk, uh, <laughs> not this time. Again, there's just like a cop in the background shooting at nothing. All, right. <laughs> All these Officer Tenpenny clones, I swear to god. A foreboding preview of Drench from San Andreas. <laughs> yeah, seriously. 
Oh, he's dead, okay. Uh, which one is alive? Probably one that I'm gonna turn around and they'll shoot me in the face. Where? Um. Where? where where's the last enemy at? Oh, wait a minute, I remember now. There's like a. Um. Where's he at? <laughs> oh, there he is! <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, this dude just constantly backdashing away from you. <laughs> yeah, really. In fact, this may just be like one of those Tekken Force campaigns. Like this whole game. Oh my god, none of you have health items? I'm not fighting this fucking final boss on nothing. Like... <laughs> Oh my god, there's seriously no health items. <sighs> you know what, let's save state real quick. Uh, maybe we can pull this off. Where's the chief's office, chief's office at? Okay. That dude had some, uh... Definitely had some Tekken backdashes going on. Uh, I will say, this may be the best time to equip the shotgun. <laughs> Chief's Office, part two. Hey, idiot. The chief's hey. office is office. <laughs> A nurse. Can you... Can you give us medicine? Okay. Uh, where'd you say it was again? Sorry. He's in rumors behind the hidden door. What? What? Rumors behind the hidden door. Um. Are there doors like the other side of the main hallway? Let me read what you said one more time. Uh, Lizard, what are you doing? All right. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's not there. Behind the hidden door. Wasn't there a door, like, on the second floor that was, like, locked? I think so. Uh... What's this? Okay, few One pair. That goes back to Chief's office. Wait, what now? Well, that, that door goes back to Chief's office. Okay. They go the other side. Alright. Oh, um, I don't know what that is, but maybe that's where he is. Well, we got these. Finally. Got a whole bunch of these, actually. That is what I'm talking about. And chicken, yeah! <laughs> chicken. First things first. And... You also probably use the protein, too. Good point. And... 
Okay. We are set. Yeah, they, they just keep chicken in here. It's a cold storage room. <laughs> Boss, maybe we should get like a fridge. It's like, no, no, we have the storage room. It's fine. Uh, so I don't know what the hell hidden door they're talking about. Maybe the basement? Ah, uh, maybe. Like where the prison is? Oh, wait, there's like more doors back there. Wait. Back where? Like, go back to the other side. Uh huh. This. Oh. Oh. Hmm, maybe he's in here. Oh, um, wait. I think this brings us just back to the garage. Damn it. Alright. I'm gonna have to look up to see what the hell she's talking about. Rumors behind the locked door. Or hidden door. I'm really glad they just explained it in the most, like, non explainable way, too. <laughs> Feels like a mistranslation. Definitely, yeah. All right, let me let me look up a playthrough again. Sorry for this, folks. I would have thought that we'd get a better hint than he's in rumors behind the locked door, or again, hidden door. <laughs> Okay, so that, that's after that's after that. Okay, so where this where's this dude going? All right. Um, yeah, chief's office. Then the nurse is like, "Hell, I had nothing to do with this." So I can tell you, please forgive me. Oh my god. Okay. I found out what it is. And what is it? I'm going to just show you. <laughs> uh wait, that's not it. Okay, so you know where we talk to the nurse and everything? Yeah. Th this is where he is. You have to punch the door. Yeah. I like how she just told us absolutely nothing there. Alright, well. Pretty nice looking bar, though. <laughs> it seems there must have been some kind of mistake made here. Come Why is he Richard Epcar? It's so here. weird. I won't get in your way as long as we work together. How's that sound to you? I know how powerful you are. You're Zanetti's successor. I'm on your side. I'm running uh -huh. for governor in the upcoming election, and I plan to win. Team up with me. And you can rule a lot more than just this shithole of a town. Yeah, that's Richard Epcar. Uh, that's Raiden right there. Say the word, and that power is yours. Why not just take us to the boss? I'm not sure. Forget all this nonsense about revenge. You gotta look at the big picture. Also, I like how, like, the big, you know, the main villain is like a guy we've seen once by accident. What do you say? Okay. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> How dare you? I was trying to be a gentleman about this. Uh. This has gone far enough. 
Time to die. I agree. It is time for you to die. <laughs> okay, so. Wait! Hey, hey, hey! Wait, I'm trying to shoot here! Whoa, what the hell is this guy doing? Wait, wait! Where did my shotgun go? It's just gone now! We start the fight. <laughs> no, get away from me! Yeah, the Wallace tech seems pretty tough. <laughs> Wait, what's this theme? <laughs> oh, cool. Why not? <laughs> That's kind of great, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, there's times where I have to reiterate, this game rules. <laughs> Oh, he's got a gun, too. <laughs> Can we just hit him with it? Oh. Oh my god! I feel like a cop shouldn't have that cool of a moveset. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> oh my god, dude, stop! Wow. I hate this man's hair. There's something very robotic about that hair. Wait, can Lizard save the day? <laughs> no. It would be great if he did, though. You really thought you could take me on? I, I just realized what Wallace is being controlled by. He's being controlled yeah. by those Eddie Gordo players that just mash the buttons over and over again. No. <laughs> okay. First things first. <laughs> I think he had a shotgun too that he just pulled out. Why did I slide forward? <laughs> God, this theme rules. <laughs> oh. It's like this is such a cool like boss move set and fight, but it's just like this dork. <laughs> like it's so weird. We should see if we can use the Zanetti straps on him. Does what now? The Zanetti straps. Oh yeah. Was it? Yeah. Uh. Yeah, the bulldog, yeah. Just throwing him into the walls. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, no, 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 no! <laughs> He's not, like, following that up, I noticed. He fights like a fighter's impact character. <laughs> Every grab in this game has that give me your lunch money energy. <laughs> Wendell has probably actually said that like a bunch of times. He just seems to type. Give me yeah. your lunch money. I'm a victim of not having lunch and it's all your fault. Uh. You really thought you could take me on? <laughs> I'm not sure, dude. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Lizard just has the fucking shore you get, apparently. Okay. <laughs> this game is something. <laughs> I'm so glad we decided to play this. Oh my god. Probably safe state. Uh <laughs> On. I, I really want Lizard to save the day, so I'm, I'm like, 
I'm just gonna load the state after he dies. Mm. Ah! Oh, we can't block with that thing. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna load already. <laughs> He's already got you downloaded. <laughs> ah, he downloaded me like a torrent. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, we have health. <laughs> oh, God. And give me that. God, it's like all this this game with like its weird map layouts and stuff. It's like it's moments it's fights like these that just make me forgive it. <laughs> oh my god, the mix-ups. <laughs> I think we hit Lizard by accident there. Oh, jeez. And somehow this fight isn't nearly as bullshit as Zanetti. <laughs> and yeah, that literally was Armor King's stop, wasn't it? <laughs> oh my god, you're right. <laughs> make the corn chip crunch. Go to hell. <laughs> oh my god, this game. <laughs> Alright. So, he just like killed the shit out of him? <laughs> oh. We're just gonna stand there with no pants. <laughs> you okay? Thanks. I'm cold. What are you <laughs> I'm shite and cold. Huh. Huh. That all you have to say? No, he said, huh, not uh. I've lost everything, including my pants. Oh, you know, nobody's perfect. Don't blame yourself. You didn't do anything wrong. What? You're right, you know. We have lost an awful lot. Yeah, we safe stated a lot too. Start <laughs> over. Yeah, see, even he knows. Just load a new game. Wait, that's it? So what if I told you there's a secret ending? There is? But you have to, like, beat the game with all three of those, like, criminal wanted level bars filled out? Oh. Well, uh... <laughs> also, unsurprising to see the director on this was KG Inafune. Uh, who's he again? Mega Man, Mighty Number no. 9. Ah. Well, uh, Toshio Arai, I recognize that name from the, uh, Battle Monsters, uh, credits. Uh, creator hit the game, Red Ash, and Mega Crap. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it said Kazuhiro Okada, I was like, oh, he started off kind of a weird note there. Huh. Man, what a... Oh. Well, that was certainly a game. <laughs> Ooh.
localization set. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to see if there's any other names I recognize here. Ah, oh, well, yeah, that's the Realm Schools uh, composer. Two people did promotion. Oh, okay, well, that, that's a. The website designer credit. The customer service! I'm gonna call up a. Uh, elaborate credit. <laughs> I'm gonna call up Yoshino Murata and be like, what the fuck was with this, an Eddie? Can you help me with that? My god, yeah, it's like marketing in Europe. I mean, it, I guess it is, you know, it is important to credit everybody, except for the voice actors, apparently. They they, they credited the guy who made the website, but they didn't credit fucking, like, Richard Epcar or anything. To be fair, there's probably the likelihood of, like, this was a non-union thing. Definitely seems it, yeah. Noriko Fuzizawa, she's the reason why Battle Monsters is a thing, I think. Every shite and <laughs> sound bite. Uh. <laughs> um, I don't really know what we do after this. Eight percent. Wait, <laughs> we're a buyer. Hell yeah. Okay. So we didn't really know how like save file compatibility works, so uh just just keep it safe and saved separately. <laughs> Kind of curious to see how like. Wait, what? Ah, oh, right, right, right. Okay. We start with a new character. Uh. All I can tell you is, uh, Aaron is like basically hard mode. It seemed that way. Uh, what about either of these two ladies? Well, it was fine. Alright. Whose idea was it to not pick Gina? That was the wheel. Gina Williams? <laughs> God, I'm torn. Uh, let's just flip a coin and see what happens. All right, we're going with Lola. The funny thing is, we could have recruited Lola. We just like missed our opportunity. You sure this the right place, Gina? Won't fuck up and get us killed. I'm gonna say we never saw Jason G either. A big deal is definitely going down here. So Gina is, uh, you may notice, is the voice of Phi from Zero Escape. Cartels behind this. They're looking to take control of the city. By extension, I guess uh, she's Molina too. Allow that. This city belongs to us, and we gotta keep it that way. We all know who your father is, Aaron. You don't need to go bragging. Hey, your father's a bullshit boss. <laughs> Oh, we've seen this cutscene already, so... M Melina Williams! <laughs> Melnina. A 
I'd be a fucked up criminal if I was raised by Zanetti. Yeah, you'd think his son would actually be good. <laughs> He's just kind of like, all wrong, but not very good. I was gonna mess with her for the remaining like 20 minutes, so. I, I honestly got thought I was playing as Erica from Shadow Wars the Session for a split second. I mean, you can get- she can get a, a hold of a sword. I like her basics more. <laughs> also this part. Watch out for this beep! Sorry. <laughs> what were you saying? The catharsis. Yeah. That's pretty good. Alright, this lady's good. <laughs> hey, remember how you were talking about Eddie Gordo mashing? You could just basically kind of do that with Gordo. <laughs> yeah. Need some kind of hack where you can bring the sealed girder into the wall, it's funny. <laughs> Truck in the way. Oh, shit. <laughs> a very matter of fact, Jim. No matter, I'll finish this myself. Yeah, she does it too. They all do it. Why did they do that? Did he just deck Jared Leto? I mean, I hope so. Jared Leto sucks. The beam is done. Yeah. It's fine that dude has a cult. <laughs> yeah, his elite's dressed just like him. I mean, do you? He didn't even touch you. I wear the damage tattoo because Lolo kind of damaged the shit out of me. Thirty seconds to an ass beating. <laughs> <laughs> is that a is that a Pikmin character? <laughs> Oh, that's where the that's where the Benamaru top came from. Came from this uh, this character. falling apart. The boss doesn't trust anyone anymore. You talking about me? She holding. He trusts in your ability. That and your tendency to survive. <laughs> so they make Chester all like shadowy this time. That tattoo. Uh, I thought it was a top hat at first. Kill anyone who stands in your way. I know what I have to do. Melvin's just across the counter, being like, "I can hear you, by the way." Understood. Oh, and another thing? Uh, thank you for wearing pants, because the other guy didn't have the courtesy for some reason. <laughs> my problem. This will be no problem. I can hold my own in guerrilla warfare, so So, did she just essentially just say, like, the same two things? <laughs> Mike Patton moments. <laughs> we were playing a fair amount of this character when we started playing a bit of it. Uh, and like, 
I guess the one issue we have is this character feels like she has the... This is very much a Hispanic character voiced by a white person syndrome. Yeah, absolutely. Dialogue is written by, uh... Yeah. <laughs> she seriously just said no, no problem, and then she just said no problem again. <laughs> side there. <laughs> I want to get in there, damn it! <laughs> yeah, I mean, um... Knock, knock. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, this is, I think, mostly a Japanese production, but still. What? But somebody had to localize it. Yeah. Because the design, it like, itself isn't really that bad. In that, you know, kind of department. And now with all that, I kind of regret picking this character. <laughs> oh, well. Shoutouts to that big dude in the fanny pack that just walked by. <laughs> that will say it's a shame we have to change her out of this alpha, because it's like a pretty good look on her. <laughs> Maybe we can just end up making her look like Erica Storm if we get like the right items. Maybe. Give her the sword. I think there is swords in this game. It's just ah, oh, that one boss lady has it. Shit. There's nothing on the body. Yeah, he like said in 20 minutes we're probably gonna call it because uh. Well, we beat the game. <laughs> Is there really that much difference with like a new game plus or anything? Or uh, don't know. Could probably like revisit this in the future or something. Just to like, oh, we could do like a, we could do like a attempt like a hundred percent or something. Uh, once we're done with that, like... might be like very very difficult. Uh, what about like 50%? 40? <laughs> Guess we'll see what we can do. <laughs> yeah, the voice act is not quite fighter MK levels of R. I'll give it that, yeah. It's such a low bar that we have to say, well, at least Lola isn't Kung Pao. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Can we attack at least? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they have health bars. I don't know why they have health bars. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Seen here. You smell like blood, blood and violence, and chicken. Why? Why do you carry that in your suit pocket? Uh huh. Change to avoid this, or you know, if you're just like beating people up, uh, you don't really have to. I honestly. Hi. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Uh, 
guy. I had seen you around here before. Also, I feel like I've died before and came back to life, and I don't really know what that's about. I can't believe they just killed this lady and Melvin off at the end there. Like, that's so unnecessary. Start dealing. Right, I forgot that this lady just talks forever. It's like, you know, um... You remember those recipes of those Flash games, Arise or whatever? With, like, the extremely long lore, pages of lore for, like, no reason? She feels like that. Now, now I'm expecting a John McCain pop scare. <laughs> I guess we can see what else we could, uh, what outfit we can get, and then, uh, call it there. Is, uh... Yeah, that sounds better. Yeah. Get! 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 Get. That was a hell of a last fight, though. <laughs> and he honestly wasn't that hard. That's the weird thing. Like, it was like Ignacy and, uh... And Zanetti, and pretty much everybody else was relatively uh, manageable. Like, there was a boss that you just straight up missed because I beat him on the first try. <laughs> right, Eugene, right? No, Gregorio. Oh, right. Yeah. So I think of the time we beat Eugene almost as soon as we started the stream. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, there was that. Thank you for approving for the slideshow. I, uh. That bumps me out that I'm usually too tired to do, like, makeup half the time, but. Uh. At least I got a good slideshow going. Ah, there's more stuff there. And we got a ton of health items now. <laughs> I mean, we did last time, like, yeah, before the last fight, too, so it's, you know, like, whatever. Oh, right, we need to change. I forgot about that. I was like, well, we can't change uh, without any clothes. And I was like, oh, yeah, they, she has, like, her default clothes with her. <laughs> I thought you were just actually the Yeti and Oro. Now I'm all three of those uh, Yu Yu Hakusho ladies at once. And Freddy Freaker. <laughs> uh, she's got the hippie jeans. I think those are called mom jeans. Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Crocodile. Um. Where's the crocodile at? That's not a crocodile. You lied to me, you aim. Okay. What, what? Stop moving around. <laughs> Why wasn't Raven doing these animations? <laughs> it's probably a hack to do that somewhere out there. That I hope. <laughs> Get ready, the Yeti. Mm -mm -mm. All right, now we can. Right, now we can. <laughs> now we can get a new outfit. Who's this guy? Oh. Well, one of the cops is strong. <laughs> Hi there. 
I do like that sound bite a lot. Hi there. Ow. Oh. Alright, so. I don't think the skirts belong to anybody. I think they're just kind of here. Uh, let's give her the Waldo look. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, we can't give her the hat, though. Damn. Just make her Freddy Krueger. <laughs> <laughs> two steps from Kurt Cobain here. Oh yeah, that's who. It's like if we gave her the green one. All right, so um, we just turned our uh, player character into Lady Freddy Krueger. That's what I call good graphics. Man, the Bishojo series got really weird. <laughs> I'd say it got better. Alright, well, next time, uh, when we eventually go back to this game, which will probably be sometime after the, uh, Grand Theft Auto, uh, we're probably in the middle of it, I'm not really sure. Um, well, uh, I'll just safe state it this time. That's fair. Um, so that's, uh, Beatdown. It's, uh, rough around the edges, but, it's game. yeah, it's, it's an experience. Uh, so, with that said, um, we're going to be doing a stream on Tuesday. Hopefully we can get Doom working again. Cause, uh, I think we, we should be able to. Hopefully. Because um, we have some ideas for that. And also, um, what was that, October 8th? Um, that would fall on a Tuesday... And that's when the new Shakara uh, wrestling game drops, so I intend... At least for PC. Yeah, yeah. So, um, I'm probably just going to do a day one stream of that <laughs> at that point. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah. um, we'll have to probably compete with New Legacy, but fuck it. Yeah, I mean, you we'll know... Do I mean, hey, look, Johnny actually took a look at my, uh, at my mod, so... <laughs> We're halfway there. He didn't play it or anything, but you know. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Um, with that, thanks everybody for stopping by and how how this game um, kind of abruptly ended, but uh, the build up was pretty good. At the uh, very least. Yeah. Uh, thanks, uh, Sasha, for being here with me as always. No problem. And we'll see you Tuesday. See you then.